All right, I'm here for, <clears throat> wow, toys and cats layout. And this one I did yesterday. <coughs> and when we first, this is we first brought Roxy home. And I had a box full of toys. And she <laughs> took out every toy out of that box, as you can see from the picture. And then she, in this picture on the second page, she then discovered a cat. <laughs> she, so she's like, so that's why I signed a wow, toys. And then it's, and cats. And then I have must chase cat. <laughs> and then the eye on her, I drew myself. See? So cute. And then the collar, I used, just took pink paper and then took white gems and just put them on there. No. Okay, no. If you want to jump up here, you jump up the other way so you don't get in my way. Because you'll mess up my, let my title. Okay, do we have this understanding now? No. <laughs> Apparently not. Oh, go. Go. Oh, she tried nuts, cat. Okay, my title is. I don't have this one wrote down. Oh, my goodness, my nose. Is all mixed up. I think her plant and school book. Plant and school book. Yes, plant and school book. Sorry. And it is cut at one and a half. And this is cut at. Let me see half an inch, these letters, and my uh, conversation bubble is cut at three inches. The ball is cut at, it says 10 because it also comes with a toy mouse, but I hid the mouse, so. And the bone and it comes with a dog dish, so it's actually set to cut out at six, but this is the size it cuts, all right? So, now let me tell you where I got all of that. The conversation bubble I got from I'm not sure. What did I get from Chore Chart? Oh, Chore Chart is the dog. And all mixed up is my journaling. Oh yeah, it is. This is from Georgian Basic Shapes, and these are from Paper Dolls, Everyday Paper Dolls. All right, and my and my uh, the dog is cut at five inches. All right. <clears throat> so, I'm going to start with my title. And I'm excited. I'll have my peach. I don't know if I said that. I think I did. That I have my peach keen stance tomorrow. I'm just excited.
here on the edge. Oh my goodness. And this is my comma. best I can do for one anyway. I don't see any on the cartridge I used. So I used, I think it was the quotation marks. This one has to go underneath my ruler just a little bit. Like that. Oh, and my paper come from, let me show you, I forgot about that. All of it come from this particular stack. Before I forget. With the exception of my journaling on the other side. Otherwise, excuse me, Hollis. Otherwise, it all come from this. Designer's couple paper by Prima. Or the second one collection in this. It's called. Otherwise, the, the polka dot one, I think, can also come from that paper stack you can't purchase anymore. Okay, so that takes care of that. I'm going to go ahead and glue down my photo mat. And it out of my way. I think I can then zoom in a little bit more. There. Put this. Then it's just oozing all over the place. And then it's up a bit. Okay. What was that noise there, Hoss? Sound like you yipping. Oh, my dog is popped up on foam. See? And he's going down here. I like this because then this is going here like this.
and then this just gets glued straight down. And then I have the ball up on one layer of foam and then since the bone was going to lay on top of the ball I put the bone on two layers of foam. See, it's up on two. I should put two here and only one layer there because now that end sits up higher. Oh well, could have done three layers on this one so it sits up the same. I wasn't thinking. Let me see what else I'm going to try something. I'll probably take one layer off of here. Let me just take it up. Mm -hmm. well, I kind of did that backwards. Okay, since this is up on one layer and the bone's laying on top, that makes two here and then two over he two layers of foam over here. So that way then it's even. All right, so that works. All right, so that is the first page. You can see once you can see it. Alright, and now let me bring in the second page, which is right here, and this is going to get, I'm going to put buttons over the holes because they're too big for any kind of brads, and it is cut at three and a half, and then my cat is from Chore Chart, and this is from All Mixed Up, and then the cat is from Chore Chart, and he's cut at three inches. And then I gave him this <gasps> ooh surprise face because it's like the dog, the cat's surprise. Like ooh, I don't know that dog. So yeah. So let me start by gluing down this title. And that leaves me one more to film. So it'll give me three more. I got uh, uh, my new one that I, I filmed two yesterday and uh, before my husband got home. And I got one saved and uploading now. And I got um, another one saving. And that one will upload as soon as it's saved. So, I've always wondered because we got Roxy and on her paperwork it says that the owner surrendered her and I've always wondered she is such a lovable dog and I've always wondered why would someone just give her up like that she's beautiful beautiful Rhodesian Ridgeback beautiful I mean she's got her moments when she fights with Haas but then a lot of times I mean if I was her, I mean, she's got a lot of patience, and then it gets to the point, because there's noise that's always stuck up her rear end, and, you know, if that was me, I'd beat him up, too. Although, I let him lick my legs, because 
um, it feels so good having him lick my legs. It's like getting a massage, someone rubbing the backs of your calves. My, it drives my husband, it drives my husband nuts. But I, and, or my feet, he'll lick my feet sometimes too. It's like getting a massage. I told him, I said, oh, but he's massaging my legs. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't do it that often though. He loves him and the cat. Him and Jasper mostly. I'll put baby oil on after my shower and because it makes your skin super smooth to use baby oil. Dry off with a towel and then use baby oil. It makes your skin super smooth. Anyway, so I'll put that on and I'll be sitting there and doing my makeup and he'll be licking it off. It's like, uh, I put that on because I wanted it on. Oh, let me put this with that. Alright, and then this is going to go centered on here. The next layout I used a lot of buttons and ribbons, so hope I didn't overdo the buttons. Because it just look cute. It's such a springy type page. I think it's more for you to be used for like Easter page. This one I'm going to kind of center because I don't have anything going up around here, so I'm just going to center that. And this I have up on foam. Anyway, so I used pink buttons, yellow ribbon, and then I have um, a pattern strip that I decided to add on the one page, and then I put yellow, since I didn't use ribbon because they're smaller buttons, so since I didn't use ribbon, I on those buttons I used yellow buttons instead of pink, I think. I think I did. No, I didn't. No, I did do pink buttons with yellow. So I did pink buttons with yellow ribbon on all of them. Maybe that's what I originally was going to do was, because I was messing with it. And I know I did yellow, since I wasn't going to do ribbon on it, do yellow buttons. Instead, I used yellow ribbon on the rest, but I guess I decided not to. All right. So we'll see that one in a minute. Mm -hmm. Alright. And then this is just going to go right like so. And this is for journaling. Let me get my glue dots. Excuse me, Alice. I just need more glue dots to dry. Oh man. Glue dots on top of those. I think I need a little glue dots in there. touched another thing of glue dots and they stuck to it because I make my own glue dots. Go a long way. Only take get the tack it over and over and just do your own different size dots. Let's see. And there I did these a long time ago and they're like super tacky still. I love it. Good for all kinds of stuff. We stick in your cricket mats and everything. Some people I watched a thing on YouTube on how to make it. It's like equal parts, tack it over and over in water. Okay. I just have another clear one that I could put over it. And all it is is that laminating paper, the backing to it. That's what I use. And it works just as good. Alright, so that is the second page. And let me bring in the first page. And zoom out. Alright, so here we are. 
Wow, toys and cats. <laughs> Alright, so that completes my layout. I thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy it. And I will see you again soon. Bye.